everyone uh, so today in the video i'm going to show you as to how you can fix the uh, update errors so this is my present build right now uh, without the windows update 14393.321 and so now i have this update error over here which prevents me from updating so let me just show you as to how you can fix this so in order to do this uh, first you need the windows iso image and a software called the virtual clone drive i have given the download uh, links in the description of this video so first install the virtual clone drive and then go into the windows uh, 10 iso website and download the latest version of uh, windows 10 iso file choose and just confirm once you press confirm uh, the download will start so download the appropriate version so once you do that you have the virtual clone drive uh, virtual disk here right click and choose out and and mount the windows image that you just downloaded double click and choose yes choose download and install uh, updates recommended and, uh, uncheck this and choose next choose accept So now a new window has come up uh, which says that it is uh, checking for system compatibility for the updates. So this will take a while uh, like in the previous case uh, wherein uh, it took some time for uh, checking the updates and downloading the updates. And now you have a ready to install window make sure that uh, you have the key personal files and app ticked and now choose install. This will take a this will take a while and make sure you don't have any uh, programs running in the background. Now all the updates have been installed and it says uh, PC will restart in a moment. This uh, working on update screen. So this will take a while for all the updates to install hi so my system has restarted and uh, the updation is complete so you can see here on my left i have the old uh, build number i just zoom it for you you can see the old build number it is uh, 14393.321 and here is the latest build number on my right 14393.447 and and if you see uh, just uh, check for my updates and my OS is up to date so that is pretty much it guys so that is how you can uh, get past the error and install your windows update I hope this is useful and informative for you and if you feel so, please subscribe for more such videos. Thank you.